This is just a quick video demonstrating my uh, rigid Versa tapper tapping head on the drill press. This is uh, it's a Procunier, Procunier style tapping head, and uh, I'm going to tap some three eighths, sixteen holes. Is a Jacobs flex collet, and then it's got a little floating block in here that tightens it up. Then you got a couple of wrenches. to get this set sometimes. Okay. Now, let me tighten this up. Now, turn it. Tap fell down. Me think of Happy Gilmore. Why won't you go into your home? Okay. Like butter.
the more thrust you put on the uh, on the handle of the drill press, the more torque is transmitted through the clutch inside the uh, tapping head. So you get a really, really good feel for whether or not the tap is binding up or if it's just, you know, the hole. So, I like this style better than the uh, Tapmatic style because the Tapmatic, they just have a clutch that, you know, it's engaged until it's not, until it starts slipping. And you really don't have sort of any direct feel. And it's really easy to break a tap if you don't have your settings just right. And this one's also got a speed reduction in it that's pretty considerable, so it slows your drill press down to tapping speed. This is a uh, what they call an NC tap, where it, uh, the chips actually come out of the hole at the top, so they're not pushing through the bottom. This happened to be a convenient tap I had. They work very nicely when you have the right parameters. And this thing is just a Jacobs taper down here. And it's just a Jacob's uh, tap chuck. And there you go, eight holes.